Hey everyone, wanted to show you, uh, I have built a few of these open EVSE kits. Uh, it's electric vehicle uh, supply equipment. It's basically what people call a charger, um, but really is just a connection to an electric vehicle. Um, I've had a couple of electric cars and a couple of electric motorcycles, and I've built um, four of these kits now. They are Wi-Fi connected. Um, there's a nice little interface here, but I've actually built my own web interface. I can manage all four of my units uh, through one, um, you know, little basically web app that I can use on my phone. Um, recently, I've gotten a Tesla Model 3, and I built another Open EVSC unit for that. Um, basically, with just a couple of minor modifications, one of which just being purchasing a Tesla cord, uh, which I just found on eBay. This one's just a short, um, it was eight feet or so, um, which is perfect for my setup and location here. And um, I've also added uh, a little DC-DC transformer so that the, the actual button on the cord works to open. So it'll power the transmitter that's inside. So let's see here, the car goes green. And we show charging, and uh, there we go, starting to pull some power. So I just wanted to show you that. There's, um, if you're familiar with the Open EVSC kits, and this is this is the newer one. Uh, the other one had a mechanical button. This one has like a touch sensitive button there under that little home icon, um, and it has a transparent case, which is pretty neat. You can see into it, and it kind of lights up. Um, and glows a little bit around it in the dark. Um, so I'm uh, just starting to uh, experiment with this a little bit more. But anyway, that um, it's basically a uh, 12 volt to 3.3 volt DC DC converter. And there's a couple other ways you can do it. I don't. You, you probably can't see it, but it's actually right. Oh, there you go. You can see it right in there. That little extra box I hooked into the 12 volt. Uh, outlet of the um, of the open EBSC unit and that powers the uh, one cable I think it's the blue one that supplies power and I'll show you again I can push the button here and that disconnects it so I can unplug the system so in any case just wanted to show you my setup there with open EBSC on a Tesla works pretty well